Hello there, welcome to my office. Inside this 11th Chancery Chatter newsletter, uh, you'll find mostly stuff looking forward with uh, kind of broad strokes. We do have one specific smaller event coming up that's for college students only, and it's an event that we'll host at my house in Dodge City on the 9th of January. It's called Break Break. Basically, if you're a college student and you've been home and college break has been great with your family, but you're ready for a break from that break, uh, come on over to my house and hang out with other students from around the diocese and catch up. And also, of course, if you're a parent and you've had a student home for a while and you're ready for a break from that break, send them over. That'd be great. We will hang out and play games and eat food and probably pray night prayer or something and really just offer our college students a chance to, to reconnect or maybe to even meet new students who are Catholic from the diocese who they didn't know. After that, we're looking at just kind of a general overview of the upcoming summer because summer missions, which for us in the diocese is the umbrella term that covers the three programs of Prayer in Action, Totus Tuus, and Camp Crystal Ray, some of those details are starting to become a little more into focus. So we now know that Prayer in Action is going to be hosted in Ulysses and in Medicine Lodge this summer. Totus Tuus, we're getting a little more of that schedule filled out for the parishes, but if you are a parish that wants to host Totus Tuus this summer, uh, you need to get that form submitted, which can be found in the in the email. You have to get that form submitted to get in the queue so that we can shuffle those dates and try to get the summer uh, squared away for that. And then Camp Crystal Ray, the dates have now been selected and the location. We can start promoting that to our middle school students in the diocese, letting them know about our adventure camp that's also, you know, fun and very much like any other summer camp that you might come across, except for it's really steeped in Catholic tradition and in the liturgy and in the sacraments. So if it looks like the shot sort of just changed a little, that's because my mom called me. Uh, thanks, mom. And uh, so I had to take my phone down and talk to her. And anyway, now we're back at it. It's my mom's birthday this month, so you can wish her happy birthday too. I'm glad she called because I would have forgotten two things that I needed to remember. And here they are. First, if you can guess who this person is right over, oh, nope, nope, right over here behind my head, right there. If you can guess who that person is on that candle, I'll give you some sort of fantastic prize from the Office of Young Adult Ministry. Also, the Skyak Retreat. So the past few years, we've done a conference for young adults in the spring. This year, we're going to do a retreat to hopefully give young adults a chance to break away just from the noise and the distraction of everyday life and to enter more deeply into prayer and to spend more time getting to know Jesus. So if you're interested in that, the details can be found in the newsletter and they'll also be posted on Instagram and Facebook and things like that before too long. Okay, I think that's it. Thanks. Bye.